Welcome back to Luxury Lane, and today we're exploring one of the most advanced, mysterious, and powerful naval creations on the planet, the USS Zumwalt DDG-1000. This futuristic destroyer doesn't just look like something out of a sci-fi movie. It represents a complete shift in how modern naval warfare is designed, engineered, and executed. So settle in as we break down its exterior design, interior features, combat performance, and what the world's most unconventional destroyer truly costs to build and operate. The first thing you notice about the USS Zumwalt is its exterior, sharp, angular, and unlike anything you've ever seen in the water. At 6-10 feet long, this massive destroyer has a distinct wave-piercing tumblehome hull, designed to reduce radar cross-section to the point where a cruiser-sized ship appears no bigger than a small fishing vessel on enemy radar. This stealth profile is one of the most extreme on any surface ship. Its hull leans inward instead of outward, slicing through waves in a way that lowers its visibility and improves stability in heavy seas. The ship's sides are clean, smooth, and uninterrupted by traditional naval hardware, creating a stealthy silhouette that blends with the ocean horizon. And then there's the deck, flat, seamless, and designed to hide as much equipment as possible. Even the anchors, sensors, and weapons are tucked inside angular enclosures to keep the radar signature incredibly low. The forward gun mounts look like futuristic armored blocks, and the integrated mast houses sensors in a single unified structure instead of multiple radars sticking out. It's minimalistic, intimidating, and designed to make the Zumwalt look like it's almost not there at all. Moving inside, the USS Zumwalt becomes even more impressive. Unlike traditional naval destroyers, it embraces automation and next-generation technology at a level few military ships have ever achieved. The interior is built around advanced digital controls, touchscreen interfaces, and highly automated systems that drastically reduce crew workload. Instead of hundreds of sailors crammed into tight compartments, the Zumwalt operates with almost half the crew size of older destroyers thanks to state-of-the-art robotics, sensors, and centralized management stations. The bridge feels more like the control room of a spaceship than a destroyer. Panoramic displays, digital helm controls, and integrated system screens give the ship's crew complete situational awareness in real time. Most systems, from weapons to propulsion, can be managed remotely from the operations center deep inside the ship. Wide corridors, improved living quarters, and more comfortable workspaces make life on board drastically better than older warships. The berthing areas are quieter, more spacious, and designed to reduce fatigue during long missions. Even the galley and common rooms feel modern and efficient, built to support a smaller, highly trained crew for extended deployments. But the heart of the Zumwalt is its performance. Powered by an advanced integrated power system producing 78 megawatts, this destroyer is basically a floating power plant. This an all-electric propulsion system generates enough energy to run a small town and it sets the foundation for future weapons like electromagnetic railguns and directed energy lasers. Almost everything on the Zumwalt is electric, including propulsion, weapon systems, sensors, and even damage control functions. This makes the ship incredibly quiet, incredibly fast, and incredibly powerful on the energy side. On the water, the Zumwalt can reach speeds of around 30 knots despite its massive size. Its stealth hull reduces drag and its electric motors provide near-silent running, critical for approaching conflict zones undetected. In terms of combat power, the ship carries vertical launch cells capable of firing a wide range of missiles. Tomahawks, surface-to-air interceptors, anti-submarine rockets, and potentially future hypersonic weapons. The forward guns, originally intended for long-range land attack operations, showcase the ship's experimental routes although ammunition changes altered their role over time. Still, the ship's combat capabilities remain cutting edge, and future upgrades will only make it more formidable. Sensors play a huge role in the Zumwalt's performance. The ship uses dual-band radar, advanced sonar systems, and a full suite of electronic warfare capabilities to detect threats long before they become a danger. Its stealth design makes it extremely hard to target while its information-dominant systems give it the ability to coordinate operations across land, air, sea, and cyber domains. The Zumwalt isn't just a destroyer, it's a command hub, 
a surveillance platform and a weapons carrier all in one. But all this technology comes at a cost, and a massive one. The USS Zumwalt is one of the most expensive warships ever constructed, with estimates landing around $4 to $7 billion per ship when including development, testing, and production. The original program intended to build over 30 ships, but due to cost and shifting military priorities, only three were completed. Each one represents not just a vessel, but a technological testbed for future Navy innovations. The operating cost of the Zumwalt is also significantly higher than standard destroyers due to its advanced systems, unique maintenance requirements, and specialized components. But the Navy sees it as an investment in tomorrow's fleet, an experimental leap forward that will influence decades of warship design. In the end, the USS Zumwalt DDG-1000 isn't just a destroyer, it's a statement. A statement of innovation, power, and futuristic naval engineering. It challenges everything we thought a warship should look like and pushes the boundary of what's possible on the open ocean. From its stealthy exterior to its highly automated interior, from its massive electric power output to its next-generation combat systems, the Zumwalt stands at the very edge of modern military design. And whether you view it as an engineering marvel, a strategic experiment, or a glimpse into the future of naval warfare, there's no denying that it's one of the most fascinating ships ever built. Outro